Hello guys, welcome to PTK. I'm going to teach you about S episode 2. I'm going to show you the topic what I'm going to teach today. So here are the topics. Variables and the functions of list are these all. But today I'm going to teach you some of the functions. Let's go to Python and I will show you. So this is Python. I said I'm going to teach you variables. So let me so variables variables. So we can call it as a jar. I'll show you. A we can I'll let I'll make a variable name A equals what should I keep one. And afterwards, we can print it. You must be wondering why it's not coming wrong. But when we write statements, it's coming wrong. Without quotes. I said in episode 1. So, the answer is that it knows it. So, it takes the information. But when we write the statement, it doesn't know. So, it doesn't take the information. But it takes the information. When we execute it, it gives back the information. To get it. So uh, let's execute it and see what happens. So it is 1. See? This is how we do. And this time, I'm going to teach you how to create list because I'm going to teach you list too. So let me make a list named fruits. equals to square brackets we should use square brackets it's important in list so elements you must be wondering why did i use this word element elements are the things that are items you can see it as items in a list so i'm going to use a technical word so you'll be able to get used to it apple the first element Banana and last of its cherry. And let's execute it and see. And it will come apple, banana, cherry. See in the execute box. See this time I printed A right and A equals to 1. So it came. And next it came. Let it came apple, banana, cherry. It printed fruits. So I'll teach you the some of the functions in list. First is append. First we should give fruits. Fruits dot append. So the spelling of append is a what I wrote here. P P P. And D. Parentheses. Parentheses means circular brackets. So what I'm going to append. An element we should append. So mango. I'll keep as an example. Afterwards. I'm going to print. Fruit and. It will come. So. It came. Apple, banana, cherry. And mango. So, I said you the first function called append. Let's go to the next one. So, I'll say you the next function is called extend. But, to know that, we should we should make another list. So, let me keep Class. Class equal to square brackets and I should write the elements with what? Codes. So first I'll write Volvo. Second I'm going to write BMW. At the last I'm going to write Ford.
So let's print cast if it's getting printed or not first. Which game what will be them forward? But the, we use the extent function for a save. If you want to take a make your two lists and you want to keep one the elements in a take from a list and give it to the other list, we use the extent. First, we should give what we want extent. It is fruits. Fruits, then dot, and we should use extent. The spelling of it is E X T E N T and we should give parity and what we want extend cars. So afterwards let me print when we print fruits and you will see it will come the elements of the cars function too. Now when we print that a, it came one. Then after we print fruits. After we appended, we added something. It's mango and added to the fruits. And we printed cast. So it will be a number four. But now we printed fruits. And when we extended it, it came apple, banana, cherry, mango, Volvo, be them dude. Four. This is called how we use extend. We say I'll say the remaining functions on the next episodes. And please subscribe and like our video if you like it. And for now, bye bye. Let's meet at the next episode.